Wall Street Memes Casino. I'm fine. And Sportsbook. Ready? Coon Cassius IFL TV here with 10 and 0. George Warren, how are you, mate? I'm good. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Yeah, I'm, I'm in a good mood. I mean, let's kind of work backwards. Um, what did you make of that knockout from Zhang? Wilder seemed to kind of be complaining and turning his back at the same time. And then uh, obviously you've got to protect yourself at all times, which is the key message here. But what did you make of that? I think, like you just said, referee, protect yourself at all times. I didn't really understand. I, 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 to be honest, I haven't watched the replay back yet, so I don't know if he, if his feet got twisted. I think he got caught with a shot that seemed to not not hurt him to put him down, but it seemed to confuse him a little bit. Found himself in an awkward position, but Zhang was in his well within his rights to continue boxing. They weren't told to stop. Caught him a big shot. Uh, impressive win there, also for Hamza Shiraz. Rumours of a potential Eubank fight. Can you make comment on that? No, not yet. Just enjoy tonight. I mean, but for me, one of the big, big future stars of British boxing. That was a coming out party for him. I'm so happy for him. Victorious uh, Nick Ball uh, over Raymond Ford to win the WBA title. Yeah, I mean, we've seen the heartbreak that uh, Nick Ball's had to go through uh, previously, but tonight was his night. No, definitely. Look, I mean, he, for me, he won the fight. It was very close. I think it was a closer fight than when he didn't get the decision against Vargas. I think Ray Ford did an incredible fight. I imagine he's going to move up in weight. He's a future world champion at super featherweight. I can even see him going to lightweight. But Nick was phenomenal. He does what he does. He gets on their chest, lets his shots go. He's very low as he comes in as well, makes it very awkward to be hit. And he was just phenomenal. I'm just, I'm happy for him. Very happy. Daniel Dubois getting the TKO win against Philip Hogwich. Um, Let's jump straight to it. The potential of seeing Daniel Dubois and Anthony Joshua is there for September, potentially. It's potentially there, yes. Yeah. So we're all off to have a couple of meetings now before we fly and we'll have more meetings next week and a few more after that. And then, yeah, there may be some news. But look, no, it's really exciting times. Again, phenomenal performance. Show character, show things again that people have questioned about. His heart, his grit, his determination. For me, comprehensively, won a fight against a very good, decorated amateur heavyweight who a lot of people thought was going to win very, very comfortably tonight, and he didn't. You know, Daniel was incredible. And obviously, starting off tonight was Willie Hutchinson um, with a comprehensive win over Craig Richards tonight as well. Yeah, I mean, I think he handled Craig tonight better than I've seen other fighters that a lot would say are more experienced, maybe levels above where Willie is currently. For me, he's always been a world-level potential fighter, and I think he showed that tonight. I think that there's big fights to him. He's got a good rating now with the BC, the WBO. Uh, spoke with His Excellency afterwards. He said to Willie that he wants to bring him back here maybe in next season as well, so that's another big opportunity. It's just great. It's just great for all these guys. And look, you know, yeah, we've had a great night tonight. I'm obviously smiling a lot, but even for the matchroom guys, you know, that have lost, they were all competitive fights. They've been great to work with all week. I can't, I can't begrudge them that. It's been fun. Um, it's been competitive, but we've had a bit of a laugh with it. And all the fighters, they all put on a great event, and I think it's just an amazing concept, and I'd love to do it again. I see your social channels have been trolling Eddie Hearn tonight. What did you say to him? I, to be honest, I shook his hand. I just said, you know, there you go. And he just, look, as we know, we're expecting Frank Smith there Monday morning. That's it. Is he, yeah, Frank Smith is going to be there Monday morning. Oh, he's got to be. Yeah, yeah he's got to be. That's, that was the deal. Andy right? Aylin's really happy, isn't he, as well? I think Andy was over the moon after the after Hams as far. Obviously, he manages Hams as well. So, yeah, when, when, we, when we knew that was in the bag, we always knew that we were, we were more than likely to win. Right, George, thank you very much. There's Hamza Shiraz there behind us. Um, yeah, thank you very much. Congratulations. 10 at 10 nil. An absolute landslide of a, a night for Queensbury. So, well done. Thanks a lot. Cheers, Kogan. Thank you. Wall Street Memes Casino. I'm fine. And Sportsbook.